sellout crowd in Fort Collins as the Colorado State Rams dominated the Oregon State Beavers in their first game at the brand new stadium. Final score, Rams 58, Oregon State 27. CBS 4's Dylan Thomas is live in Fort Collins tonight. Dylan, I know you're a proud Ram yourself, and I'm sure a lot of excitement on campus today. Hopefully the green and gold doesn't really give that away all too much. It's crazy to think just a few years ago, this behind me was actually the largest parking lot on the campus with some greenhouses off to the side. Well, now it's actually the brand new newest stadium in all of college football. Today, nearly 38,000 people packed into the stands, which set a record at CSU for the largest home opener ever. <laughs> For the first time in 50 years, this is a different animal. Football returned to the campus of CSU. On campus is where <laughs> college football is supposed to be. Something even the skeptics are warming up to. I was really upset that it was going to go on campus. I didn't think it was a good idea. 2012 grad Jake Taylor's family has brought their 1958 Jeep to games for decades. My dad actually used to drive it to CSU games when he went here. So this is the first time it's back on campus. That is yeah. so cool. <laughs> Ooh, there you go, Phil. A staple of tailgating. Snuck it in there. Did you really? Yeah. I didn't even see it. Ugh. One and one on, yeah. yeah. Amid Rams spatulas, magnets, flags, and of course, Rams beer. This is... Awesome. People are going to be able to walk around that haven't been here for years. A skeptic. Like, hey, how about this? Let's just land a helicopter. Caught in the awe of new tradition. <laughs> and with the formalities complete, Rams football was once again just that football. Hey, this is wild. Look at it. Everyone's actually getting into it. This is cool to see. This is the way it's supposed to be. A busy day nonetheless. Photographer Micah Beta doing a great job capturing all of that for us today. The next time CSU will be taking the field here at this stadium will be in two weeks, and we'll make sure to have the highlights of this game coming up tonight in sports. We're live in Fort Collins, Dylan Thomas covering Colorado first.